Details emerged of the attempt to use a snow barrier to prevent fly ash dust at Nuruchuli power plant. Led by the Environmental Foundation Guarantee Limited or EFL, an agreement was reached to build a wind barrier at the coal yard of the power station. This agreement was reached to mitigate the concerns of local residents and environmentalists who complained bitterly about the adverse environmental effects in the area surrounding the power plant. A sum of 723.7 million rupees was allocated to build the wind barrier. We reveal today that the proposed wind barrier for which the foundation stone was laid today is in fact a form of a mesh that is used in Yongming, USA to control heavy snow drifts. The discovery of the proposed new snow mesh to be used to control ultra-fine coal dust particles was made by diligent environmentalists from the Environmental Foundation Guarantee Limited when they decided to fact-check the six-page proposal for the wind barrier at Norochole. In court documents seen by News First, the full extent of the attempted deceit is evident. In a remarkable use of technology, EFL reverse searched the information provided in a six-page document from NCPP. The reverse search revealed that the image supplied in the six-page proposal was taken from a report titled, quote, Controlling Blowing and Drifting Snow with Snow Fences and Road Design, unquote, authored by Ronald Tabler of Tabler & Associates. The image also carries the company's watermark. EFL points out that the figure is not related to wind barriers but shows the deposition of snow when snow fences of various specifications are erected. Expert opinion suggest that the use of such information does not serve any worthwhile purpose but appears to be a smokescreen to obtain environmental clearances. More details will follow.